So in the first four to five months of having an infant, it's really convenient to have a couple different places that you can put baby down to take a nap. That's called a bassinet or a Moses basket. I'm Joey with Baby Earth, and let's talk a little bit about what to look for when buying a bassinet or a Moses basket. Now here are two really good examples of different ones. This is a bassinet and it's pretty sturdy. You give it a shake, that's really important. You want to make sure that, the, that it's got a nice base, it's sturdy, and that any passing dog or cat or person, even if they knock into it, it's not going to tip over. Now, these are much different than a crib. This is actually a crib behind us. See, a crib you can't really move. Bassinets are made so that you can move them easily from room to room. So think about what rooms you're going to have to go to. Do you want one with wheels? Do you need one that collapses and folds? If you get one with wheels, make sure the wheels lock and that you know how to lock them. If it collapses, make sure that you can carry it. You're not going to be struggling trying to get it up the stairs to let baby sleep in the office with you while you work. Now, these pretty little baskets here, these are actually something that I like to think of as something cute to have next to the fireplace and a nice place to set baby down. But they are really not intended to carry baby around. You know, they're really flimsy and it's just not safe. So if you do buy one of these, I would just keep it in one spot. Now, something else to think about is the mattress. So they all come with these cushy little mattresses and they're very light. These are not intended to be cribs. They're just somewhere for the baby to nap. So it's a light mattress. You want to make sure that it fits. A good rule is take two fingers and place it in between the mattress and the edge. And if it fits easily, it should fit a little snug, but if you feel like you could fit three fingers in there, then the mattress doesn't fit. So, also, they're not made to have tons of blankets and bedding, so don't put too many extra things in there. I would say maybe just a light blanket with the mattress and a stuffed animal or something to comfort your baby. Well, I hope you learned a little bit about bassinets and Moses baskets. I'm Joey with Baby Earth.